Ricky here, and today I wanted to talk to you about trenching an irrigation pipe, something that I have a lot of experience with and I truly love. So here we have a machine with a four inch trencher, and this is common in the industry. Most people use these if they're doing residential light commercial irrigation. It does a great job of trenching. It allows you to put multiple one inch pipe in. You can run up to three inch pipe. But you're wondering, well, why can't I use the four inch? In a previous video, I showed that the four inch corrugated would slightly fit, but four inch PVC will not. Well, that has to do with the fact that PVC piping is measured from the inside diameter. So this is listed as a three inch PVC pipe, and that's the inside diameter. If you actually look at the outside diameter, you can see that it's well above three inches. So if you had a four inch pipe, the four inch pipe is gonna have an outside diameter larger than four inches, therefore it won't fit. Now there are some things that you can do. There are trenchers that are, have larger chains that you can get. And I wanted to show you most trenchers in the industry have this piece on the front, and this is called your crummer. You can see it right here. And the idea what the crummer does is it drags the dirt back so that the dirt will get kicked out to the side with the chain. A lot of these crummers can be replaceable and you can get a larger crummer. So in some cases, if soil conditions will allow, you can trench twice and increase the size of the crummer to then clean it out to where you may be able to drop that four inch pipe. But if you have heavy clay soils, heavy rock soils, that may not be the case. So what are your other options? Or let's say you're doing a French drain. Uh, you're gonna use the styrofoam peanuts or you're gonna use aggregate. Well, maybe you need to step up to a little machine like this. All manufacturers make these machines they have retractable tracks so you can get inside narrow gates. This particular machine goes down to 30 inches so you can get inside a 30 inch, six inch gate and it has a diesel engine. You have a blade on the front that is expandable. And on this one, they have a nine inch bucket and you can see this nine inch bucket allows the four inch corrugated pipe to sit in the trench and you have plenty of room to put aggregate around it or if you're using the pre-manufactured corrugated pipe with styrofoam peanuts, this may be the solution. You can also upgrade to about a 12 inch bucket. My experience with these machines is that probably 12 inch is about all you want if you're in hard soils. If you're in loose sandy soils, maybe you could go a little bit bigger. But that's two options that you can use for one, your drainage and your trenching.